Hi there, quick video update for you today. I'm close like all the planet. To all the people that ask for me, I'm fine. Not in home yet, but I'll be near, I hope. I, I was in another country when all this started, so I'm here for a while, but I'm fine. I'm in a good place, nice views. And the most important is that I've got my camera here and I assembled a small set so I've got plenty of action. My plan is to make a video about the basics of stop motion with all the principles of animation and taking special care of timing and spacing. To make that video about basics of stop motion I'm using candy and this is my main character and this is my set so you have camera there, candy that fall and my main light is this normal lamp with this LED cube here that lights the background so my candy is well lit from behind and it makes a nice translucent effect in here that if this stays in place stay here from this camera it's something like this and yeah this is dragon frame in my computer you can see this is the live view when i animate it It's like that. My camera is the Canon ID. I've got a manual lens. This is a 50 millimeters from Raikkonen. And I've got a tripod. This is a Manfrotto one, light but steady. And this light, the Lum Cube. Uh, it's super nice. It has a lot of different intensities and yeah super bright i will leave the links of this and the camera and everything in the description just in case someone needs them another important thing is that there are no blinds here so i'm forced to animate only at nights so i'm doing all this stuff at nights and i plan all the shooting during day. Animating candy is super super fun because they are flexible so you can change the shape of it and it goes back. That's that's really amazing. You can also Squash it and it just recovers the position. So you can you can do plenty of things with with the gummy. The only and big issue is that it doesn't stay still. So to make stop motion, like you'll see, it's it's all about having poses. You have to plan your poses, move it a little bit more than you need and when it hits the position you should fast that picture for your animation. Another thing that people ask me in Twitter and Instagram where I've been sharing this, this animation or these pieces that I'm making is how do you keep the, the candy there without falling. Well, I'm using the wires that you have in when you buy croissants or something. I cut up this, this wire because I don't have anything else here. And then I, I make a stand. Like, I don't know if you can see it, but I 
pinch this there Oops. and then it's, it's more stable it has something that holds the, the position from the back with a little piece of blue tack here so mainly that's it that's the set make sure to subscribe and click that bell if you aren't already to be notified it full <laughs> when the next video about basics on stop motion animation and all the principles of animation is published until then stay at home wash your hands and take care see you in the next one take care bye